Hey, it's Stacy, and today I want to talk about gratitude. Let's discover how to be your ideal self and reach the goals and the dreams that we desire because everybody has a dream and everybody can make that dream come true. So today I wanted to talk to you. Hey, how's, hi Sylvia, how's it going? What do you have gratitude in your life for today? Hey, Atu, how are you doing? What do you have gratitude in your life for today? I want to hear about it. Come on guys, let me know. So I today I wanted to just like talk about gratitude. There's so many people in life that go through life and they don't have gratitude in their lives. And you know, the problem is is why do they don't they don't feel like they have gratitude in their lives is because they focus on the past. Now think about it when you're a, a kid and you're driving in the back seat with your parents. Remember how we used to look in the back seat of the window and we used to stare out the window and we, as we're driving the cars would pass and we would pass towns and go through all these different towns and one of the things that you know that we actually don't realize is that every time we that time and that date and that moment will never come back the past is the past so you know people type kind of like just focus on in the past and they don't realize that you know that by focusing on the past we're just holding ourselves and in, into moments in our lives especially if they're not good moments and we don't realize those moments are never going to come back so why dwell on it just take the good things from your past and focus on those memories and those moments and have gratitude for them and that's one thing that people don't realize is that you need, need to just not focus on on the, the bad things in life in the past focus on the good things and focus on the positive things that happen and and feed off of those things in life and you know and don't you know another problem that holds people back from being having having gratitude in their lives is that they focus on the goals and the dreams that they want to accomplish in the future or they didn't accomplish in the future and they lose instead of instead of focusing on the moment on now they lose track they lose track of the they lose track of what they should be have gratitude for now and it's all about living in the moment living in now now what do you gr have gratitude for that's what i want to hear by people i want to hear what do you have gratitude in life for what in life makes you feel uh deserving and, and makes you feel good about the life that you're living you know, when I think about what I have gratitude now, I think about the people in my life that love me. I think about the beautiful nature that when I walk out of my house, I see all these different things. Hey, hey, Amar, how you doing? How's it going? What do you have gratitude in your life for? I want to hear it. Hey, Jay, how's it going? What do you have gratitude in your life for? You know, we have to be aware. We have to be aware of what's going on. And we have to realize that the past is the past. And those those moments, we just need to focus on the positive moments. And for the and and not focus so much on the future and what's gonna be and the goals we have to reach and the goals we didn't reach yet and, and all the other stuff because that's not that's not gratitude. That's just causing you stress. So you have to live in the moment, live in the now. And you know one of the great things that you could do is actually take a piece of paper or go into and create yourself a journal and write down the 10 things that you have gratitude for and really focus on those those things and actually feel good about yourself because that's where positivity draws in when we have gratitude for the things in our life and we look down at that piece of paper and say hey you know what i have a lot to be gra have gratitude for i have a lot of great things going on in my life then we find out hey douglas how's it going what do you have gratitude in your life for i want to hear it i want to hear these things from everyone and you know we have to just focus on the now so by writing those things on a piece of paper or in a journal we're really realizing that hey i have a lot of good things in life that i should be i should have gratitude for and not focus on the past and not focus on the present because those things don't matter what focuses on now because we don't know what the next day may bring 
So it's it's useless trying to focus on the past because we can't change it, and we can you know really uh, fo we can't focus on the on on the fu on the future because we can't predict the future. The future you know we never know what the future may bring. Things are always changing, so it's now that we have to focus on. Let's live in the moment now, and let's be and let's have gratitude for the things that we have in our lives at this moment. You know, take some time to really focus on everything that has meaning in your life and ha be positive and think about, you know, by be having gratitude and by being positive, you're gaining strength. And with that strength, you're able to actually move forward in life and rise above the chaos and rise above everything that's going on in your life and reach your ideal self because it's all about reaching your goals in life, feeling good about yourself. And the only way to move ahead in life is to feel good about yourself now. So now, today, I want you. Today is my, my, my assignment to you. Find a piece of paper, find a notebook, get a journal, and write down 10 things that actually, that in your life that you have gratitude for. And then take that, those 10 things, and then put, put it away, put it in a letter, uh, put it in an envelope and put it aside and then focus on the moment and say what am I going to do to make my life better and you know and then move forward in life and start setting goals and setting objectives for yourself because today basically what I wanted to say to you is that we in order to be happy in order to to live a full life to live a happy, healthy, and productive life, we have to be happy with ourselves, and we have to have gratitude. So don't focus on the past. The past is the past. You can't change the past. You can you can't you can only focus on the present and make goals for a constructive future. So in order to do that, we have to feel good about ourselves, and we have to take a moment out each day to have gratitude. And gratitude is so important. And journaling is one way to actually develop an uh, ideal uh, in your head to realize how much gratitude and how many great things you have in your life. And that's going to give you strength. And take 10 minutes maybe or 15 minutes in the morning when you wake up. Maybe do a little meditation. Close your eyes and think about all the wonderful things around you. All the wonderful people and all the things that you have gratitude and then maybe actually take an action and thanking a few people in your life for being there for you because you actually it's those people that actually make you the person you are today you know those people who love you those people who support you those people are here for you and really you need to actually you know take a moment to give gratitude to people cuz that makes people feel good and if you show some gratitude and you show people, you know what, thanks so much for being such a great friend. I really appreciate you being there for me. You know, that's going to that's gonna really make that person feel appreciated. And I, they will return the favor and they will say, they will share with you what makes them happy that you're in their life also. And these things will make you, you know, feel good about yourself. And it will help also make you feel good that you also actually made somebody else happy by showing them that you appreciate them in your life. So with that said, always have gratitude. Gratitude is key to positivity. And positivity is the key to overcoming our struggles and our obstacles in life. To move forward, to rise above the chaos, to become our ideal self. So take a moment today and ask somebody, you, you know, share some gratitude and, and share a moment to, and think to yourself, who, what do you have gratitude in your life for? And for, and we're also, uh, for today, I'm giving away my book, Empower Yourself. Don't let your obstacles empower you. And if you go on CoachStacyChilemi.com slash free book, you'll get this book for free. So visit my website to get this book for free. Hey Mo, how's it going? We're talking about gratitude and how gratitude is the key to positivity and how positivity gives us strength to become our ideal self. 
is there's something in life that you actually have some gratitude for share it with us we want to know you know it it's your moment today to share gratitude and it's your moment today to feel good about yourself so take a moment and think about what you have gratitude for thanks so much for coming i'll see you soon i'll see you on monday and if you have any questions dm me and if you have any suggestions dm me i want to hear what you have to say because your voice matters i care about you and i want to hear what you have to say because what matters to me is that my words are helping you because i care about you and i want to see you become a better person i want to help you get there so with that said have a great weekend guys and take a moment to really breathe in the beautiful air outside to take a walk and appreciate the nature around you and to, and to also to think about those people in life that you have gratitude for and maybe just going out there and saying hey guys i appreciate you you mean a lot to me if it wasn't for you maybe i wouldn't be where i am today or i wouldn't be exactly you know the person i am and share that love with somebody because this is what the world it should be founded on is peace love serenity and giving back giving back to what people have given you in life so with that said namaste and have a wonderful day